The legislature is trying to do things differently this year. They're trying to get all their work done before the end of the session, which is in just two weeks. They've created self-imposed deadlines, and a big one is coming up tomorrow. May 6th is when they said they would announce budget targets for key bills. So will they? Esme Murphy with tonight's Talking Points. In early February, the leaders of the legislature and the governor stood together and promised an orderly end to this legislative session. That end is now two weeks away, and it's not clear how Democratic House Speaker Melissa Wortman, Republican Senate Majority Leader Paul Gazelka, and Governor Tim Walz can reach agreement on major spending bills. Speaker Hortman and the governor are adamant about a gas tax to improve roads, gun control measures, and keeping a 2% medical provider tax that funds $700 million a year in health care for low-income Minnesotans. Republicans say they are against all of those proposals. Speaker Hortman was a guest on WCCO Sunday morning. We have a really clashing philosophy. So the first part is respecting and understanding the other person's point of view. We, of course, come at creating a state budget with very, very different uh, processes. Uh, the Republicans starting with a dollar number and Democrats starting with the values and what sort of state we want to build for the state of Minnesota. This coming week at the legislature, conference committees will meet to try and make up differences between the Senate and House bills. Because this is a budget year, the legislature has to pass spending bills by the end of session on May 20th, or they will have to go into special session. And without an agreement, the state government could shut down July 1st. Esme Murphy, WCCO 4 News.